Hi, let's discuss on the topic mensuration exercise 13.3. Here we have we are going to look uh, on the uh, right circular cone. So we'll first discuss on the formula. So this C curved surface area of right circular cone of base radius r and slant height l is equal to pi into r into l this is the curved surface area so here r is the radius we'll have a cone now here r is the radius and l is the slant height this is r now we are going to find the value of l the value of l can be found by a formula formula square root of r square plus h square now this distance is h so l is equal to square root of r square plus h square and using this value of l we can find the curved surface area using the formula pi into r into l now coming to the exercise Question number one: Diameter of the base of a cone is ten point five centimeter, and its slant height is ten centimeter. Find its curved surface area. So diameter is given as ten point five centimeters. So base radius will be equal to ten point five divided by two diameter by two, which is equal to five point two five centimeters, and the slant height slant height is equal to 10 cm this is nothing but l so l is given to be 10 cm so we are asked to find the curved surface area and the formula will be pi into r into l 22 by 7 into r substitute the value into l which comes to 165 Centimeter square. Question number two. Find the total surface area of a cone. If the slant height is twenty-one meter and the diameter of its base is twenty-four meters, so here the slant height, that is L, is given to be twenty-one meter, and the diameter is twenty-four meter. so the base radius will be r this is equal to 24 by 2 12 meter therefore the total surface area will be equal to there is a formula for total surface area so the total surface area of the cone is pi r into l plus r so this is the formula for total surface area of the cone so substituting the values 22 by 7 into 12 into 21 plus 12 this is equal to 22 by 7 into 12 into 33 this is 8712 by 7 that comes around 124 uh, 4.57 meter square Moving on to question number three. Curved surface area of a cone is three point eight centimeters square, and the slant height is fourteen centimeters. Find number one the radius of the base. Number two the total surface area of the cone. Question number one. Subdivision number one. Now given is curved surface area is three point eight centimeters square. 
the slant height to be 14 cm now base radius is asked so formula for csa is equal to pi into r into l pi r l is given to be 308 therefore 22 by 7 into r into 14 will be 308 or r is equal to 308 into 7 divided by 22 into 14 take all the other <coughs> numbers in the on the other side r being the left hand side to find r so find r equal to 7 centimeter hence the radius of the base is equal to 7 centimeter now question number 2 find the total surface area so, total surface area formula as we saw it is pi r into l plus r this is equal to 22 by 7 into 7 4 to 14 plus 7 because it is l plus r so 14 plus 7 22 by 7 into 7 into 21 which comes around 462 centimeter square therefore the total surface area of the cone is equal to 462 centimeter square problem number 4 the conical tent is 10 meter high and the radius of its base is 24 meters find number 1 slant height of the tent number 2 cost of the canvas required to make the tent if the cost of 1 meter square canvas is rupees 70 given height is 10 meters radius equal to 24 meters number 1 find the slant height we know as per the formula it is r square plus h square which is equal to 10 square plus 24 square 100 plus 24 square is 576 which comes to 676 so square root of 676 is 26 meter so l equal to 26 meter then hence the land height is 26 meters problem number 2 find the cost to find the cost we have to find the curved surface area so the curved surface area will be equal to pi into r into l which is equal to 22 by 7 into r is 26 into 24 r we have l is 26 and r is 24 l we have found here which is equal to they have asked for the cost so the cost per meter square will be rupees 70 is the cost per meter square so we have to divide multiply it by 70 so the cost for whole area will be the whole term will take this term into 70 we have taken this as such because it gets cancelled here 70 so 17s are 70 the multiplication will be easier so the answer is 137280 so the cost will be is equal to rupees 137280 this is the cost of the canvas next problem number uh, 5 what length of the tarpaulin 3 meter wide will be required to make conical tent of height 8 meters and base radius 6 meters assume that the extra length of material that will be required for stitching margins and wastage and cutting is approximately 20 centimeters the height is given to be 8 meters nor is given to be 6 meters and wastage is equal to R is 6 meters and wastage is 20 centimeter 
we know l equal to r square plus h square so which is 6 square plus 8 square this is equal to 36 plus 64 which is equal to root 100 which is answer is 10 so l is equal to 10 meters now we know the curved surface area is pi into r into l which is equal to 22 by 7 into 6 into 10 which comes to 188.4 meter square now the width of the tarpaulin is given to be 188.4 so the can be divided by 3 so we have to find the width which is divided by 3 will give you 62.8 meters so the area divided by the width will give you 62 and the extra length is there so the extra length required will be to given 20 centimeter we, when we convert into meter this is point to meter so the actual length that is required is asked so the actual length will be equal to the original length that we has we, that we have found out here 62.8 plus the wastage extra length 62.2 which comes to 63 meters so this is the actual length Question number 6. The slant height and the base diameter of a conical tome are 25 meter and 14 meter respectively. Find the cost of whitewashing in its curved surface area at the rate of 210 per 100, 100 meter square. So, length is given to be 25 meter. The diameter is 14 meter. So, hence the radius will be 14 by 2 which is equal to 7 meter now curved surface area so curved surface area is equal to pi into r into l which is 22 by 7 into 7 into 25 so the curved surface area will be 550 meter square now we have to find the cost of white washing at the rate of rupees 210 per 100 meter square so it will be 210 per 100 meter square for 550 area so 210 by 100 will be for 1 meter square so for 550 meter square it will be equal to rupees 1155 question 7 a joker's cap is in the form of a right circular cone of base radius 7 centimeters and height 24 centimeter find the area of the sheet required to make 10 such caps here radius is 7 centimeters height is 24 centimeters now we have to find the area of 10 caps now here l is equal to r square plus h square 7 square plus 24 square which is equal to 49 plus 576 which is equal to 625 so l is equal to root of 625 will be 25 that is 25 centimeters now curved surface area of a cap is equal to pi into r into l 22 by 7 into 7 into 25 which comes to 550 centimeter square so curved surface area of 10 caps will be equal to 550 into 10 which is equal to 5500 centimeter square question number 8 a bus stop is barricaded from the remaining part of the road by using 50 hollow cones made of Recycle cardboard. Each cone has a base diameter of 40 cm and height 1 meter. The outer side of each of the cones is to be painted 
and the cost of painting is rupees 12 per meter square what will be the cost of painting for all the all these cones now the diameter is 40 centimeters height is 1 meter 50 cones the rate of rupees 12 per meter square now r equal to 40 by 2 which is equal to 20 centimeter now in terms of meter it is 0.2 meter so l will be equal to square root of r square plus h square 0.2 square plus 1 square 0.04 plus 1 this is equal to 1.04 so square root of 1.04 will be 1.02 so l is equal to 1.02 meter curved surface area will be pi into r into l 22 by 7 into 0.2 into 1.02 which comes to 0 0.640 meter square so csa for one cone csa of 50 cones will be equal to 0 0.640 into 50 is equal to 32.028 meter square no cost of painting all these cones will be equal to Thirty two point zero two eight into twelve, which is equal to three eighty four point three three six approximately three eighty four point three four. So this is the cost of painting at the rate of twelve per meter square.